All right, uh, next we can do this. Uh, the next problem we're going to do is problem 17.11. Uh, and uh, so it says, beyond the examples in figures 17.10, uh, 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 there are other models that can be linearized using transformations. For example, alpha 4x e to the beta 4 um, x. OK, linearize uh, this model and use it to estimate alpha 4 and beta 4 based on the following data. Develop a plot of your fit along with the data. Okay, well, um, so uh, the first thing I'm going to do is just pull out my nifty little uh, uh, data tool just as we did before. And so we're just going to go over to MATLAB. Oh, wow. Let's clear that. And let's um, make sure our data tool is closed. Alright, so we don't have any uh, if we type who, we can see what variables we have. We don't have any. So we can say x equals, and then I'll paste the data that I just put in here. And then y equals, and let's grab the y data. Alright, so there's the y data. Uh, and then uh, let's let's estimate the data. So let's go go to the curve fitting tool um, and then we just say our x data we'll call x, our y data we'll call y um, and we will do I said y data is y, yeah, had a hard time with that uh, and then we're gonna go uh, let's, let's just go right to custom and then say um, yeah let's see uh, it said A. I'm just going to use A and B, right? A uh, times uh, X times uh, E to the BX. And it wasn't negative BX. I think it was positive BX. Yeah, it was positive BX. And so we can just say that's our... Um, Custom fit. And so, um, boy, that's all there is to it uh, with MATLAB. So uh, we are getting our A coefficient is 9.897. Our B coefficient is minus 2.532. Uh, we also get 95% confidence bounds on, uh, on those estimates. And that's all there is to it.